Hi there, class. Welcome back. Uh, we are now on to 3.6, and today we're talking all about order of operations. So write your name in the corner, and today's date. So when we have a question that has multiple steps or multiple operations in it, we have to know uh, what order we're going to do things in. And so what we say is that when solving equations with multiple operations, we follow the order of operations. And the order of operations, there's a there's an acronym that helps us remember that. And uh, the way we remember it is with something called bed mass. So that's just a little mnemonic device that helps us remember what we're going to do. So uh, you'll remember that bed mass uh, stands for the following. Uh, the first is brackets. And then we've got exponents. followed by division, then multiplication, and finally we've got addition, and we've got subtraction. Now, just a couple things to keep in mind. The first is that uh, exponents, we don't actually, I'm going to put an asterisk beside this because we don't actually do exponents in Math 7, but you're going to be doing it soon enough, so it's important for you to know kind of where it rests along the, the line there. And the other thing I just want to make you aware of is that uh, division, the, the, these two here, division and multiplication are essentially, uh, they're going to be equal in the sense that we think of division and multiplication as being the same level of importance. So even though D comes before M in bed mass, it's actually sort of a tie. And in that case of a division and multiplication, we actually just go from left to right to follow through. And the same thing here happens with addition and subtraction. Addition and subtraction are also basically a tie. But I guess uh, bed mass sounds better than BEMDAS. And so that's the order that we put that in. But uh, addition and subtraction are the, are the same level. And we're just going to do them in order from left to right. So if we have a question like the following here, this is a pretty ugly um, operation, set of operations that we need to do, 12.376 divided by blah, 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 and on and on. Uh, the way that we're going to do this is to just actually go through step by step. Now, so for any of these questions that have m these multiple operation steps, you're actually allowed to use a calculator. And you'll be allowed to use one on the, on the quiz and so on. So I'll just have this here on the side to help me out. Um, the way we want to do this is just identify which step we want to do first and then follow through uh, and do it one step at a time. So when I look through my, my set of operations here, the first thing I notice is that I've got these numbers here in brackets. So I'm going to do that step first. And I'm just going to go ahead and do it on my calculator, 4.75 plus 1.2. Okay. Now to keep things uh, simple, I'm going to just write my answer down here, 5.95. And I'm just going to do that one step at a time. And I'm going to fill in the rest of what I've got. Uh, to do here, plus 2.45 times 0 0.2 minus 1.84. And then I'm going to go through it. Again, I'm going to identify which steps uh, I can do next. So you'll notice that I've got this one right here. I've got a division that I have to do right here. I've also got a multiplication that I have to do right there. And I'm going to do both of those uh, in my next step. So uh, I've got uh, 12376 divided by 5.95 and I get 2.08 plus I'm going to do this step as well 2.45 times 0 0.2 is 0 0.49 and I can't forget that I still got this last one here that I need to do uh, minus 1.84 Okay, so the next step we're going to do, I've got an addition and I've got a subtraction. And like we said before, they're basically uh, equal. They're at the same level. And so what I'm going to do first is the addition because I'm going to follow from left to right. So I'm going to read my equation from left to right. And this is the first thing I, that I ran across. So 2.08 plus 0.49 is 2.57. And I've still got minus 1.84. And then that's the last step that I'm going to do there. 2.57 minus 1.84. My answer is 0 0.73. All right, that's it for 3.6. Don't forget to do the recap.